The only Yakima News team taking action for you. KIMA Action News starts now. Good evening and thank you for choosing KIMA Action News Live at 6. I'm John Kennedy O'Connor. A local non-profit is using the power of flowers to help heal trauma for people in our community. KIMA's Alana Martinez reports on how something as simple as a flower blooming can make a huge impact. Flowers help remind us how precious life is. During the height of the COVID pandemic, Dr. Cara Lawley, owner of Canyon Blooms, began dropping off large vases of flowers to bring joy to her good friend Candace, who is in a nursing home facility. What she didn't know was that Candace was handing those flowers off individually to nurses to pass out to other patients, sharing the gift with everyone around. This was the time in COVID when they weren't, residents and facilities weren't even allowed to sit together at meals, right? So this little expression of connection that came through the flowers was very, was very beautiful and very useful. That planted the seed for petals for patients to grow into what it is today. Cara and a group of volunteers work hard to grow, cut, and arrange flower bouquets for 24 local organizations. All of these tulips are being crate grown ahead of season to brighten the lives of veterans, people in hospices, and others who may need a little light during this time of year. January, February, March are awfully dreary times to be in, to be bed bound. So having bedside flowers during those months is a really nice addition to our program. They're currently doing about 50 to 100 vases a week, but average around 400 to 500 during the high production season. Last year, they donated just over 4,000 vases in total and plan to exceed that once their expansion construction is finished. The magic behind all of these flowers are providing healing for both the giver and receiver. We're finding that a lot of the volunteers that come to help are also dealing with their own grieving or their own life events and this being able to come here and be part of this team has been therapeutic for them as well. There are plenty of volunteer opportunities available for community members who would like to be a part of creating something beautiful for the good of others. Thanks, Alana. And bouquets are also available through subscriptions and can be purchased at the farmer's market and special events. 100% of the sales go to providing farm fresh flowers to those facing hardship in our communities.